there's a whole universe of what's called compounded GLP-1s. So basically, this whole thing happened because there was a shortage of the drugs. And according to the FDA's rules, um, you're allowed to get a compound version of the drug when it's in shortage, which means that other people can sell it, not just the companies, the two companies that make these drugs right now. It's created this very gray area and a lot of confusion, I think, because people think they're generics. They're not. Um, you don't know what else might be added to the GLP-1. So some of these places are adding things to promote extra weight loss or, you know, as a vitamin that you may or may not need, but it might actually change how well the drug works for you. And then there's, you know, some companies that are basically selling counterfeit GLP. There have been reports of people getting injured by that. They're trying to rein it in, but it, this went on for so long and people were able to afford these drugs, um, which are very expensive, by buying them through these compounded versions. And so it's gotten a little out of control and been hard to wrangle back.